Hi guys, I wanted you to see how Zoom works so if you wanted to hold your own study group. Um, here are a couple of helpful tips. So if you click on the Zoom app and you open that up on your computer, what you'll see is that you will see this. So this is going to be what you see at the very beginning. Now what you want to do is before you start a new meeting, you actually want to go to meetings. And you're going to give people this meeting ID. Okay. Now you can also hit copy an invitation and then paste it into an email. Okay. So once you have started a new meeting, careful, you're about to see me. Hi guys. So once you start a new meeting, okay, here's what I wanted to show you It's down here where it says share screen right now, only I can share my screen. If I wanted to share my screen and I wanted other people to be able to share their screen, I would hit that right there. So that says multiple participants can share simultaneously. Now, here's why that's so cool. If I hit the share screen button, so not the arrow, but the actual button, it'll say I can share this screen here, or I could share my whiteboard. Now, if I click on whiteboard, what that's going to do is it's going to bring up this whiteboard right here where I can write or type or do pretty much almost anything. All right, so if I hit stop sharing, it just goes automatically back to the video part. You can also have a chat, so if you want to talk to somebody um, individually, you could do that through there. And lastly, if you wanted to record your study session, you could hit record right here. All right, that's really all I wanted to show you, so I hope this helps you out in making your own study group Zoom session.